Did you know that artists start with some type of inspiration before they make some artwork? It's true, and you probably start with inspiration when you make your artwork, but maybe you didn't even know it was called inspiration. Do you know what inspiration is? Inspiration is when you get an idea and you're so excited to try it that you get like a warm fuzzy feeling inside and, and you just get so much energy and you just really want to get up and do whatever it is that you want to try. A lot of artists get excited to try new things when they see artwork made by another artist. They might see a picture like this and they might just really, really, really get excited to make their own winter picture. Do you have favorite things you like to do outside? What are some other things that get you excited to make art? Hmm. Sometimes when I'm trying to decide what to draw or paint, I get excited to draw my family, my friends, or even activities that I love to do. Do you ever do that? Oh yeah, we like to make a picture of our favorite food, french fries. Oh, that sounds good. Yeah, that sounds really good. Well, I prefer broccoli. I guess someone else prefers bananas. Let's meet an artist who lived a long, long time ago. Her name was Mary Cassatt. She loved painting pictures of her nieces and nephews. She loved painting families doing fun things together, like going for a boat ride, reading together, playing with pets, and many other fun activities. Can you tell what these people are doing in some of these pictures she made? Ah uh, yes, this painting is called Sarah Holding a Cat. The name says it all. This is her painting called Children Playing on the Beach. They look like they're having so much fun. These people are feeding the ducks. Have you ever gone out to feed the ducks before? Mary worked so hard to become an artist throughout her life. She became famous for painting mothers and children. Can you tell that she lived a long time ago based on her clothes in this picture? She was born in 1844 and died in 1926. She was part of a group of artists called the Impressionists. The Impressionists decided that they didn't want their pictures to look like a photograph anymore. They wanted them to look special, just like paintings can look. Can you see all the beautiful brush strokes, soft lines and soft colors in her paintings? This is one of her most famous paintings called Young Mother Sewing. Mary taught us a special lesson that you can be anything you want to be because she became an artist at a time when many people were telling her she couldn't. Let's meet another artist who loves painting people doing fun things together. Her name is Diane Dangle and she loves painting kids doing fun activities like being ballet dancers, going to the bakery with their family, playing baseball together, having tea parties, woo that looks fun, and going to the toy store. Do you like to do any of those activities? It looks like these ladies are having a birthday party. Looks like this kid's excited to get a haircut. 
But this kiddo in the back is not too happy about his haircut. Have you ever been to a barbershop? Well, obviously. Can't you tell by my great hairstyle? Meet Colin Bootman. He is another artist who shows us many pictures of people having fun together. This one is called the marching band. Can you see all of those fantastic instruments? This beautiful painting is called Good Night Baby. Ah, there is just something so magical about gazing at the stars together. Colin Bootman does a beautiful job of capturing exciting and fun parts of everyday life. Like this grandmother excitedly reading to her granddaughter. Let's take a look at the artwork of Carmen Lomas Garma. She was born in Texas in 1948. She has done paintings, paper cutouts, wood cutouts, and lithograph prints. Her pictures are so fun to look at that they've even been made into books. Can you tell what the people are doing in these pictures? looking at other people's artwork. Oh, it gets me so excited to go make my own artwork. I think I'll make a picture of myself playing this guitar. Yeah, man, it's so cool. Let's get out some paper and make a picture of our own. Maybe you could make a picture of a birthday party or something else fun you like to do. Draw your picture and color it in. And then you could even give it to someone as a gift. You could make a portrait of yourself or someone in your family like Mary Cassatt did. You could also make a picture of some fun things that you and your family or your friends like to do together. Have fun creating. Bye!